With the U.S. moving closer to carbon regulation, one of the biggest issues facing many businesses in the country will be how to track how much carbon you actually emit. We're talking about the whole integrated cradle to grave <laughs> carbon output of your business. I know it may sound silly, it isn't, I know I snickered there, but SAP believes it as a solution using software technology available today. Peter Graff joins us now, SAP's Chief Sustainability Officer, and I can tell you have a sense of humor, sir, so uh, thanks for being on the show. Okay, so how in the world uh, do you, first of all, let's just talk about the risks. If you don't know your carbon footprint, the EPA could fine you a whole lot of money, right? That's true. They can charge you up to $32,500 a day. And that means that uh, they have signed to law on September 22nd um, that um, for a variety of industries, people have to report their carbon footprint. And uh, what that means is that they need to figure out, starting on January 1, 2010, what the carbon footprint is of their operations throughout the whole year and have that report on the table at the EPA by March 2011. Well, how are they going to do that? I guess that might be where you come in. Well, the challenge is that um, we see a lot of carbon talk today, but many people are using papers, pencils, Excel spreadsheets in a non-repeatable process. And that's a true challenge because you want to be consistent year over year and you want to have a repeatable process. And the risk of non-compliance is um, a big one, but even bigger is the risk of coming out with a big uh, hoopla in the carbon footprint that you then have to um, retract later on. So the challenge for organizations is to truly have an automated way of running these processes throughout the entire operation, throughout all the facilities, all the plants, and throughout mm -hmm. their entire value chain. All right, and, and we have a screen up now of some companies that are already using your software to do just that. Um, but one thing you said at the beginning of the interview actually captured my attention. You said if you don't comply, they could fine you $32,500 a day. That's but, right. but if I can't tell how much I'm emitting, how can the government? I mean, are you, are you selling this to the government, too? That's the challenge. I mean, they say it's only 13,000 uh, facilities that actually go over the limit of 25,000 tons per year of carbon emissions. But the truth is, you know, you don't know where you are unless you've started to measure. So you need to figure it out and find a way to understand if you're above or below the threshold and if you're actually required to report. All right. Well, thank you very much, Peter Graff. We appreciate it. Thank you. And now the battle over health care continues. House leaders have reportedly covered.